Hi, Sonny Hill. Uh, it's Monday the 20th of Feb, and you're here with me, Adam Clark. Um, hope you're having a good week. Um, I know it's only just started, but I um, hope you're having a good week so far. So we're in week eight of the um, Bible reading plan, and um, we're just going to start attacking Genesis, the f tail end of Genesis from 31 onwards. Um, so today's reading is 31 to 33, and um, basically... Jacob is on the run from Laban. Um, so he's on the run from one side, but he's also about to meet his um, brother from old. <clears throat> um, and he's quite nervous about that. And um, just as I was reading through it a minute ago, you know, um, I'm sure we've all feared something and we've kind of built it up in our heads to be something bigger than what it actually is. Although I suppose Jacob did did have a uh, a fine reason back in Genesis twenty seven, uh, verse forty one, um, Esau actually you know is saying he's going to mourn his dad and then he's going to go and uh, kill Jacob for what he's done. But um, you know from this now Jacob is absolutely bricking it. Um, he's he's sending loads of gifts ahead of him to go and meet his brother. And he's hoping that he can reconcile for what um, his trickery, basically, for mould. And it just made me think, yeah, you know, have you ever feared something and um, it's turned out OK? Many, you know, many things in our lives come at us and we build them up to be huge giants. And um, I just think, you know, don't worry about it. You know, God's got it. And uh, just trust God. You know, God told Jacob to move on to the next bit of land and um, he would be with him and he'll bless him. And it's e easier said than done, I suppose, to trust that. But, you know, we've seen God do things again and again and again in the Bible and, and even today, you know. And, um, you know, I just think for me, just to trust in God in whatever that issue is um, and he, he'll just bless you from it. Um yeah, that's it really, you know, just um as you as you go about your day or your weeks, just think start thinking about anything that um you, you panic about or you worry about and just give it to God and uh, I just trust that God will bless you in that. Um yeah, you know, Jacob was filled with so much grief, but then Esau just embraced him and the love and the relief that Jacob must have got must have been immense. So um yeah, don't don't panic, chill out. If there's anything um, worrying you today, just trust God in it and he'll bless you. Have a great day and I'll see you tomorrow.